I'm Brownfield Commodity Market Reporter John Perkins with the Market Minute for Monday, February 12th. Soybeans and corn both closed higher. The primary source of support was an oversold bounce, and the trade's continuing to keep an eye on weather in South America. Now, conditions generally look favorable in much of Argentina over the next couple of weeks, but rainfall totals over the next few days are expected to be scattered in Brazil, with some of that precipitation missing some of the drier growing areas. That's definitely something to continue to keep an eye on, especially with the recent decline in production estimates for Brazil. Wheat was mixed, essentially just consolidating, oversold on one hand, but seeing continued pressure from bearish export demand on the other hand. Live and feeder cattle were mixed, watching the distribution of this week's direct cash cattle show list. There was an initial spike from last week's direct cash cattle trade, but that evaporated fairly quickly. And hogs ended the session mixed, mostly lower on spread trade and profit taking, ignoring the midday strength in pork. With the Market Minute for Monday, February 12th, I'm Roundfield Commodity Market Reporter John Cooper.